Scorpio, this is Delilah Rose and welcome back to Delilah's Spiritual Spot coming with your weekly reading for October 19th through the 25th of October. Um, please take whatever is meaningful for you and also take this opportunity to like, share, and subscribe. Also hit the little notification button so you get notified when I drop a new video or when I go live for free readings. I normally go live with free readings Tuesdays and Thursdays, 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I will put up a notification so you can get a reminder. Again, this is going to be free of charge. Um, if you'd like to make a donation, you can, but it's you're going to get cards and a reading regardless. So let's just jump into it. I'm going to be using my Magical Unicorn cards by Doreen Virtue. Virtue, excuse me. Scorpios, it's time to be creative. You're creative in general, but it's a time to tap into that creativity. Draw, paint, think, write, act in creative ways because you need to get that energy out to help your, you know, whatever emotions you need to work through. Listen to your true feelings. I feel like for many of you during this time, your true feelings are clouded because you may be thinking about someone else. It's time to think about yourself. Don't let others talk you into doing something that you know is wrong. Be strong. Be strong. And if you have to withdraw and go into yourself and use your creativity to drown out that noise, then you do it. I'm really feeling that. I'm going to use my five cents tarot. Let's get into the shuffle. Let's do the Scorpio. Scorpio. Let's see what else Spirit has for you. I'm going to be pulling three columns. Subconscious, conscious, advice from Spirit slash outcome. And then three clarifier cards. So let's just get into this. Two cards came out. You have the Ten of Needles or the Ten of Swords. Right. That goes with this here. I love that. You have the universe that came out with this. And I love 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 this I love this conscious or the now right subconscious what's happening now and your advice um, and your advice and outcome column you have the six of matches here and then I'm gonna clarify the chariot is clarifying um, the Ten of Needles and the Universe card. Actually, we're going to pull this because this wants to come out. We have the Page of Pentacles uh, clarifying this um, Nine of Needles in reverse. You have the Seven of Cups clarifying this um, Six of Matches or Six of Wands. So let's just jump right into this because this is very important and I want you to listen, Scorpio. It's your time. It's your time to be expressive. It's your time to be successful. But sometimes being successful in yourself is letting go of the dead weight. Letting go of the people who talk you into doing something that you know is wrong. Because they're trying to bring you down to their vibration. And you, you can't listen to that noise. You know this. Right? Because you've been in tune. Again, this is for all Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising. Please take whatever is meaningful for you. You know this. Right? You feel like you're getting stabbed in the back. You feel like with this Ten of Needles that people don't want what's best for you. Um, you know what you need to do. Because you know that you have the ability to be very successful especially with your creative energy there's a chance for infinite growth but not only infinite growth in your financial or career life but in your emotional life because you know you need to cut these people off cut off who is no longer serving you or you, for your highest greater good this is going to come to a head this week because we have the chariot card bringing balance back into your life, bringing balance back into your emotional and mental life um, with speed. So this is happening and it's happening soon. 
consciously you want to let go but it's not easy to let go because you have an attachment to these people you care for them you love them you know you know that they need you but it's time to take care of you right it's time for you to take on this endeavor with this page of of this page of buttons it's time for you to start your journey your inner work start your life right in a positive manner not in a negative one and i know that's not easy but this is the time where you're going to see people for their true colors you're going to wake up out of the fog the advice from spirit with the six of matches is if you let these people go, you will have a faster road to your success. Your success is probably inevitable, but why take the toughest road there? You're going to have success. You're going to have a claim. You're going to be victorious in your life quickly because you've let the past go or you've let these friends go. This is clarified here by the seven of cups. The Seven of Cups speaks of possibilities, of wishful thinking, of choices. So it's telling you if you make the proper choice, it'll be the road to, of least resistance. Right? Clarified by this Knight of Cups. This Knight of Cups is going to bring new energy into your life. People who vibrate higher, who are emotionally there for you, could be male or female or a masculine energy. So this is what you want to breathe back into your life. Bringing new energy, positive energy is going to feed this creative side. It's going to feed your success, feed your soul. This is for you, Scorpio, and this is for October 19th to the 25th. I'm Delilah Rose, and this is Delilah's Spiritual Spot.